Hello you guys, this is Jacobs and Mac here showing you a quick tutorial on showing you how to do cloning effects. So, as you can see here, see my fellow friend here play some games while I'm just sitting here talking to you guys. Alright, um, let's get this started. Alright, so um, let's first start off by um, opening up Final Cut Pro and getting your videos in. Um, one of the, one main tip that I have for you is that you use a tripod. This took me many tries to get because just one little slight movement could just ruin the whole thing. Alright, so once you got your footage in, you just put it in and then you look to the point where you started off and press and keep looking. Hello, you guys. Alright, so I start right there, and that's the end point. So I press I. Hello, you guys. This is Jacobs and Mac here showing you. Alright. Hello, you guys. This is so... Jacobs and Mac here showing you a quick tutorial on showing you how to do cloning effects. So, as you can see here, see my fellow friend here play some games while I'm just sitting here talking to you guys. Alright, um, let's get this started. Alright, so once you got your footage in, you put it in. Or you can just put it in like this. Then you use your second footage and you look for the part where you want. So I think right here is a good spot. And you have to make sure it's the same yeah, amount of time. So this okay. took about right. um, 15 seconds. And this right here is a total of... See, that won't work because it's not long enough. So 15... Let's just do more, just in case. So, what you're going to do is you could just drag it in, or just to make it easier for yourself, connect, just press right here, connect the selected clip to the primary storyline, or just press Q. And I'll just put it right on top. Alright, so once you got that in, you have both your clips on top, but as you can see, you can only see the top one, but you can't see the bottom one. So what we're going to do is have this... Well, for my my example, it wasn't. It was easier not to use this tip, but the next thing you would do is select this tip, get your inspector, and put the opacity down. So you could see exactly where your second both are. So since I already have it in set, um, I already know what to do. So. Just put the opacity back down, and then select your top clip, and just crop it. So, crop it. I think right there is about fine. And there you go. As you can see here, we'll just scrub through it. This is Jacobs and Mac here, showing you a quick tutorial, and showing you how to do cloning effects. So, as you can see here... And it's simple as that. Alright, um, hope you liked this tutorial. Please subscribe, like, and comment. And thank you.